we're having a chilled beach day down in Portanax, Ibiza, but I've seen just around the coast this little island that looks like it can be accessed via foot. So I'm gonna have a little walk around and explore around that little island. I was having an iron whether to wear flip-flops or not, because I knew the ground was gonna be a bit sharp. If they're wet on the other side, they just get really slippery inside the shoes. So I thought I'll just go without. This is the little island. So I think you can walk across here just about, then we can have a little adventure over the top of that. Got a look over the salt. Yeah. It's gonna be first glimpse of the actual crossing. We're gonna be getting wet, but it's definitely doable. Always very slippery to be fair. So it's hard to judge how deep it is when the water's so clear. But I know a lot of these rocks in our beef are quite crumbly, so I'm gonna be a bit careful climbing over here. This is sharp on the old feet. Oh. Now, I assume there's going to be some sort of rough path up here. Can't be the only person coming over here. Looks like a few people have scrambled up through here. So let's see what this is saying. Oh, it's all crumbling loose, so. I've got to be careful where I, where I step. <laughs> Proper shrubland. Feet are getting absolutely abused on the way up here. Emma's just out of sight. Emma's just tucked around that little beach there. I'd wave to her if I could, but she won't see me. The main aim of this little venture is just to get up to the top of it, I think. I'm sure there's some really cool and nice bits of water and coastline around this little island, but it's just gonna take too long to explore barefoot. Oh, sun cream in the eye. Oh, there we go. Top of this little island. Decent little views around. That seems pretty solid here, but all that's quite crumbly down there, you can kind of see what happens. It gets this overhang, then it will probably collapse over. And I wouldn't mind betting there's a bit of an overhang coming off of here. Let's see if we can see. Oh, yeah, it looks like a big old drop down there. We definitely don't want to be falling down there this side because I will not be found for a while. And you can see just where it's all gone down over the years. I'm not gonna bother going that way. It looks like it slants and it's just gonna be a bit of a slip off anyway. So, not gonna bother with that bit. Don't know what the hell that's from. Must be from like scraping through some bushes or something. I'm gonna see if I can get back down this side of the island, but from the approach, it looked pretty crumbly and steep this side. So I think I will have to go back, send me the way I came. Oh Jesus. <laughs> I was almost tempted to walk out there, but then I just saw this little gap and literally, that is all going straight down to the ground. I think I might even be overhanging here. Thank you, little hole. I'm just gonna step back a little bit. Don't mind if I do. <laughs> oh, me up. Doesn't look like any other easy way down. I'm gonna head back down this side of the island to get back to the beach. Gonna go have a little swim and a cool off. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed that one. Ibiza's an awesome little island. It's not all about the party scene and clubbing and whatnot. It's actually a really nice place just to visit and come for a, a chilled holiday. I'm gonna fight my way back down through here. And remember, have fun, stay young, baby. You! Boy, that's better. <laughs>